Greetings. Last time we saw we had a little bit of a problem with a layer. Now the layer problem has been is we're going to fix that now by changing the axes. Now our current axes right here is this red, green, and blind. So if I go to tools, axes, I can drop my axes down to someplace different. So if I go to my turn off my cancel, if I turn off my top layer, don't make it visible. There is the bottom axis. I don't want that at the bottom. I need to pull this whole thing up. So when I go to my move up tool, there it is. I can move. I can move it to the left and right. But I can't necessarily move it up. So let's rotate this again and try the pull tool, which is right there. And look at that. That's kind of interesting. I, we actually get ourselves a little cone object here by pulling it up. That's kind of cool, but it's not what we want. Control Z. I'm going to go ahead and erase this by clicking and dragging over the objects. I can erase the whole thing. So going back to the bottom floor right there, let's add the make sure our axis is correct. Hit the O key, rotate. The yeah, correct location, but I'm going to pop the axes on the corner, right there, right there, and right there. So there's my new axes. Let's go ahead and draw a new rectangle right over the top of it, like that. Let's try it again. Should have stuck. And no, what are you doing? There's there. Maybe my section plane is getting in the way. Let's try turning that off. You right click to delete the section plane or erase it. There it is. I knew it was a problem. Okay, so now I've got my second floor. You can see that it's more or less the same height. I hit the O key and wrote that down. You can see there's a problem here that I wrote not being the same height. So my section planes are actually getting in the way. So let's go ahead and delete all of these unnecessary objects. Holding down the erase key, I can erase them. And let's go ahead and push these rooms down to the right size. I hit the O key, rate, push the room down the same height as on face. Same height as on face. Control Z, Control Z, O to rate, pull up the room again. And there it is on face. That's good. Now I can drag this room across. And now it fits as the same in the same depth of my existing room. There's on face. There's on face. O key to rotate. On face. So my whole, I now have a second floor on my existing room. I hit the section plane tool. Tools, section plane, O key to rotate, section plane, click on it, and now I can see all the way down from the top all the way to the bottom floor. Thank you very much for watching and happy computing.